Hey, what is up, everybody? Michael Crump back here again, talking about the latest and the greatest in PlayStation homebrew news and much, much more. There is this brand new application by Nomadic, and it is called PS5 Discord Rich Present Client. Now, I talked about this on Homebrew News, but today we're actually going to go and do a tutorial of this step by step. So if you're wondering, what does this tool do? Well, if you use Discord and you have a jailbroken PlayStation 5, you can report out that status of what game or which application that you're currently in. As you can see right here, it shows an example of Dark Souls. It also gives information such as how long has been elapsed. Here's one with our favorite homebrew application, which is Autumn's Flow. And then obviously if you're idle and there's just another game. Now, in order to use this, there is a few things that you're going to need. The very first one is, is that you're going to need to be using at least ETA HEN version 1.4b, and you need to have the following entry enabled in your data, ETA HEN slash config dot any. It is advised that you have a static IP address for your PS5, and then you are going to need to do some work with the Discord developer page, as well as provide your PS5's IP address and the application ID, which came from Discord. In order for us to begin with here today, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to download the Windows client. So I'm going to go right over here to the releases page. So I'm just going to go ahead and download that very latest one right there. The very first thing that we are going to need to do is to change this flag in our config.any. Now there's a couple of different ways that you can go about adding this entry into your config.any file. You can obviously do FTP or you can use something like PS Explorer, but you will have to type that in. Let's just go ahead and we'll switch over to the PS5 and we're going to use PS Explorer in order to update this file. Okay, so over in PS5 Explorer, I'm just gonna go to the data folder and then ETA hen, and then there should already be a config.any file if you've ran ETA hen before. So hopefully you already have this base file that you can just add on to. So we use the right analog stick to get down to the end here, and then I'm gonna press R2, and now it's just a matter of typing it in. Okay, so there we go. I just finished typing it in. It's just discord underscore RPC equals one. And then I'm just going to save it. And now we will need to reboot the PS5 in order to reactivate ETA HEN and to be able to turn on our discord RPC. Okay, I'm rebooted. So I'm just going to go and jailbreak again. And there you can see it says Discord RPC server listening on port 8000 down at the very bottom of that. So now we have done everything that we currently need to do on the PS5 side. So let's switch back over to the PC. So let's go ahead and let's set up Discord. So it says go to the Discord developer page. On the top right, click new application, and then you can just name it something like PlayStation, and then select the application and copy the value named application ID. So let's go back to the Discord developer portal. We're going to come right over here and we're gonna press new application. I am going to paste in PlayStation, and we're gonna go ahead and click create there. And then the application ID, just go ahead and press the copy button there and put that in notepad or something like that because we're going to need it in just a second. Do keep in mind that you are going to need to actually have the desktop Discord app installed. So let's go ahead and let's run the client. So hopefully you went ahead and downloaded the executable from the releases page. And so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to run mine now. Okay, so I went ahead and I extracted mine to a folder called PS5 on my D drive. So I'm just going to run the executable file name here. And so the first thing that it says is enter Discord application ID. Again, you got that from the Discord developer page. So I'm just going to paste mine in here. And the very next thing is that it asks for your PS5's IP address. I'm going to go ahead and paste mine in as well. And then we'll press enter. 
And then finally, we'll just go ahead and press yes for that. Okay, so if you see this right here, then everything looks pretty good. Okay, so back over on the PlayStation 5, I just opened up Items Flow. And what you can see right here is, is that now the log is being updated. So it says updated activity for Items Flow Game Manager. And so if I go into my version of Discord right now, and I go to my name, then you can see right up above me, it says playing a game, PlayStation Items Flow Game Manager, and how long that I have been in it. So I'm going to go ahead and I am going to launch a game, and we'll go back over here to Grand Theft Auto, and then I'm going to select Launch. And we can see right now my status is set to idle. And now it is showing Grand Theft Auto 3. Anyway, I think this is going to be a super fun project to use. And I hope you all use it as well. Thank you so very much for watching. And I'll see you on the next one. Michael out.